Hey, yo, check this out. This is Wayne Wanda, representing for Warwicka Hill TV. You see the vision, don't you? See the vision. Warwicka Hill TV. Keep it locked. These are the issues that we need to address. We need to address. We need to address. You understand what I said? You understand what I said? You understand what I said? You see? Set the bar for the youth. Then. For the youth. Then. Share, like, and subscribe, and stay tuned to the channel. I right? know you're on this. Yes, I. Brothers and sisters. Greetings in the mighty name of his imperial majesty, Emperor Alistair Asiad first. And all things good and wonderful amongst us. Welcome viewers and subscribers. Viewers, if you like the content, subscribe. I'm a quite good platform. You see if you don't know. You know. Big up is Lisa Smith, you know. The lovely, wonderful Lisa Smith. Enough love and respect, you don't know. Thanks for your continuous support and encouragement. You see. Now, I notice a little break in the news, and I you mean, know, I hear you nobody know, asking about it more. It and to say, come like it just. I don't know if a man them keep it secret because they don't want to jinx it or what. You know, see it, but you know, black man and the clans, clans man them out for work, you know. Mm, by Monday morning, Monday, the latest, it look like, you know, them go to work. I, mean, I read the story to you, you know. Scene and then we we get na the discussion. You know, see, cause I want you look. We see it a long time. We see it long time. We talk about it. I have a pyjama me day. You know, see it. Me get up and I do that one. <laughs> well, whenever I just sleep, still we just kinda get ready for go sleep. But I don't know where I can for go on. You know, see. <laughs> yeah, man. Black man out for walk star. Black man and the clans massive. I'm not surprised because at the end of the day, a Jamaica that, you know, see it. And me, me, I say from day one, say, from the witness now, nah, call politician name and them thing there, that now nah, say nothing. You know, see it. Anyway, I can read from the nationwide publication, you know, see it, nationwide radio Jamaica. The prosecution in the Wanda and clansman gang trial on Thursday failed to produce supportive evidence to affirm their case against the alleged gang leader Andre Blackman Ryan and his 27 co-accused failed you know failed is that a guess I spell business huh? failed watch her Chief Justice Brian Sykes raised several questions regarding the absence of documentary evidence and the chain of custody for items achieved from scene from crime scenes to substantiate the narrative of the farmer gangsters turned state witnesses you see it ah, i don't know sir p sir p grieve for that one here Asta. you know see people in jamaica we worry about crime and violence all one of our spanish town right and our cup spanish town africa you know see it <sighs> But the prosecution submitted that they have presented all they had. More in this report from Robin Williams. Hold on there. An expert, we have some record in here, I might play the device now. An expert police witness testified how he prepared a ballistic match report outlining linkages between crime scenes and firearms. He examined a total of 10 incidents to which the prosecution had linked the defendants to. The police expert assumption was that all the evidence he examined were recovered from the scene. There was all the evidence he examined were recovered from the scenes they were said to be from when they were submitted to the forensic lab. The prosecution revealed that at, that of the ten incidents, two had testimonial evidence that the items from the scene were in fact carried to the lab for examination there's the murder of a man known as Dooley on red hills road in st andrew where a police witness had processed that scene he picked up nine spent millimeter casings 
that were packaged and taken to storage. Another police witness te testified how he took those spent casings to the lab. The prosecution submitted that the findings of the ballistic report is consistent with the testimonial evidence, but Chief Justice Sykes questioned if there were crime scene photograph of crime scene photograph or any other documentation relating to the incident. Now these are very important um, um, uh, you know task they may a practice a principles basic principles of investigation and presenting evidence and things like that and supporting the evidence in a court they may have basic thing we know them thing we don't, have to, we don't need nobody in the seat if you don't have them thing you don't bring them to court just for this facts away then you insult your own intelligence and the judge has and now waste the court time you see to have something where you know you see they may have basics in in in, in an investigation you see it and prosecution and submit them as well I buy out and sell out this go and say be a cover out but I know our business that we, we we know that from long time you see it the prosecution submitted that the findings of a ballistic report is consistent with the testimonial evidence but Chief Justice Sykes questioned if there were crime scene photograph or any other documentation relating to the incident. The prosecution answered no. Justice Sykes went further, asking if the spent casing from the scene or the ballistic certificate were tendered into evidence. The Crown answered no. Justice Sykes re remarked, What we have here is a faith-based test statement. He went at he went on saying, it can't be that you have a homicide in Jamaica in the 21st century and no record can be found. Can't be. Can't be. You know, see, that have to be, um, you know, purposely done. You know, see. All right. Earlier in the trial, the scene, the crime scene investigator testified that the photograph could not be located as the hard drive had developed a problem and that the backup storage system had crashed. Now, all of them evidence have to bring come a court come show to the judge because although the judge would have just fed up. <laughs> and the judge would have all of them, you know, see it. Yeah. The prosecution continued submitting uh, that there's also testimonial evidence regarding a, a double murder at a new, new nursery in Spanish town on September 9th, 2017. The officer who processed that scene retrieved spent casing and took photographs which were taken to the lab. The firearm linked to that scene was recovered by the police on November the 17th, 2017 from the defendant Tariq James. The weapon a six sar and and the photograph from the crime scene were all tendered into evidence. Justice Sykes states, Justice Sykes stated, look at the contrast between the two incidents, chalk and cheese. One is documented, the other zero documenting of any kind. He further said that the proof of the underlying crime needs to be completed. The prosecution maintained that they have put forward all the evidence they have. It is what it is, my lord. What kind of rask? It is what it is in a judge, you hear that? <laughs> and the judge accept them, them, them sort of, you know. It was evident that the police investigators inside the courtroom was agitated by the remarks of Justice Sykes. The prosecution wrapped up its response to no case submissions presented by the defense. Chief Justice Sykes is to make his ruling in the case come Monday, June the 20, when the trial reconvenes at 10 a.m. You know, see it. The man them gonna walk. I thought on a day like this when the judge shows such um concern for the 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 old thing, you know? 
But I'm play the recording because you know, hopefully people might get a different An answer. expert police witness testified how he prepared a ballistics match report outlining linkages between crime scenes and firearms. He examined a total of 10 incidents to which the prosecution had linked the defendants to. The police expert's assumption was that all the evidence he examined were recovered from the scenes they were said to be from when they were submitted to the forensic laboratory. The prosecution revealed that of the 10 incidents, two had testimonial evidence that the items from the scenes were in fact carried to the lab for examination. There's the murder of a man known as Dooley on Red Hills Road in St. Andrew, where a police witness had processed that scene. She picked up nine spent 9mm casings that were packaged and taken to storage. Another police witness testified how he took those spent casings to the lab. The prosecution submitted that the findings of the ballistics report is consistent with the testimonial evidence. But Chief Justice Sykes questioned if there were crime scene photographs or any other documentation relating to the incident. The prosecution answered no. Justice Sykes went further, asking if the spent casings from the scene or the ballistic certificate were tendered into evidence. The Crown answered again no. Justice Sykes remarked, quote, What we have here is a faith-based statement, end quote. He went on saying, quote, it can't be that you have a homicide in Jamaica in the 21st century and no record can be found, end quote. Earlier in the trial, the crime scene investigator testified that the photographs could not be located as the hard drive had developed a problem and the backup storage system had crashed. The prosecution continued submitting that there's also testimonial evidence regarding a double murder at New Nursery in Spanish Town on September 9, 2017. The officer who processed that scene retrieved spent casings and took photographs which were taken to the lab. The firearm linked to that scene was recovered by the police on November 17, 2017 from the defendant Tariq James. The weapon, a SIG saw, and the photographs from the crime scene were all tendered into evidence. Justice Sykes stated, quote, Look at the contrast between the two incidents. Chalk and cheese. One is documented, the other zero documenting of any kind, end quote. He further said that the proof of the underlying crime needs to be completed. The prosecution maintained that they have put forward all the evidence they have, quote, it is what it is, my lord, end quote. It was evident that the police investigators inside the courtroom were agitated by the remarks of Justice Sykes. The prosecution wrapped up its response to no case submissions presented by the defense. Chief Justice Sykes is to make his ruling in the case come Monday, June 20, when the trial reconvenes at 10 a.m. Robian Williams for nation fiasco fiasco that man you know see John, uh, big a big fiasco now the thing is let me say and i like where i pray for no one got prison you know you know, see still we not accept and appreciate of certain certain actions and attitude you know see more time you don't even have no compassion or you know, I uh, have no concern for some people and them attitude, particularly the clansmen, them and how they move. You know, see, them and them, I'd like, at them first come with some, some, some sort of thing, so it come like a devil I work through them. Every killing is wrong still, you know, but when you observe, you know, you have to, yeah, you have to just say it as it is, because it is what it is, just like with the, the prosecution saying after them cases. So. But we know, say, Hopefully we know say a whole heap of, you know, you know, I don't forget them youth to go down, send them youth to go to prison, a whole heap of other people name of go card, some whole heap of big man name, politician and, and them sort of thing name of go card. You know, see, you know, see, but it's, a, it's another, you see, it's not a disgrace, man, the, 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 the 
it's a disgrace. You know, see, it's a total disgrace. You know, see, but I am a nah, they are insult I intelligence by saying the police them um no know where the mad. You know, see, police them know where the mad. You know, see. You know, a corruption, you know, and big money we're running, and big money I go run to cause the you know, the DF them man, they forget themselves why up. And the man they all call certain um call in certain favour. And the thing about that is that the man they better off to everybody concerned out of road than in a prison when they're in a prison they're more dangerous. When enough of them they are road, it, it them easier to catch. You know, see, and right now, without enough man threat where them callous attitude and action yeah, and principle and approach towards stepping is enough big wig quaking at them boots when black man them and, and them man they are prison and the whole crew they are prison. You know, see, that too fragmented, that too, yeah, and that hard for contain. If the flow of information or the leakage of information, you know, see, hard. Enough man out there fed on a chamber, you know, see, and enough man are just it easier to disassociate themselves from them. So as things, so as for things like this don't happen again, because life went on without them, you know. Life did still like, carry on without them, and everybody has survived and I live. You know, my mind should have some money that I survive better. You know, see, so, you know, you never know. A dash, some man gonna get dash when them come back a road, cause, like me say, it's easier for, for daily. You know, man, they you know, they are take the idea, can run up and down and I take the stress and thing like that. But yeah, I hate that. I'm a feel like so well then, hmm? you know, them all work. I feel like them all work Monday morning or Monday. But we make a watch and sit still. <laughs> you know, see. Yes, I we give thanks, you know. You don't know. More blessing.